Welcome to the Nav Viking tutorials. I'm Johannes Goodmanson, founder of Anecta, a Microsoft Dynamics NAV Gold certified partner. Hello and welcome to the Coffee Mac tutorials. Um, we're going to keep going on Outlook integration with uh, Business Central. And uh, I did a previous video where I kind of touched on the very surface of uh, Business Central and Outlook. But uh, right now I'm going to do something that's more practical. Um, so if I go here into Customers and Business Central uh, in the Idatum Corporation, I'm actually going to go into Customer Contact, take a look at the contacts. Uh, and notice here I've actually added myself as a contact. So right now I'm working for the Idatum however you pronounce that, corporation. Um, so since I'm a contact, um, <clears throat> my salesperson is Paul, uh, paul at yellowsubmarine.com. Uh, if I actually look at Paul's uh, inbox in Office 365, I've actually sent from my email to Paul a request for a quote. So here I just have in the headline quote, please send me a quote for the Paris chair. And if I click on that, um, I actually get a little icon here. Oops. So it's Business Central, right? So if I click on Business Central, uh, Business Central will identify where the email is coming from. So it's coming from the Adatum Corporation because I was a contact there and bring us all the information regarding the Datum Corporation. So this is really cool. Here you can see uh, year-to-date sales, you can see the balance, if there's any past due, everything inside the email above um, the information here. So there's no past due, so this is a good customer. Um, so we want to just go ahead and create a quote, right? So how do I do that? Let's send a uh, quote for the Paris chair. I just go into new sales quote right here. Um, and it actually suggests a line, the Paris guest chair, because it figured out of the line here that this was the item that I probably want. Okay, so let's say I want uh, three, and just hit okay. Um, okay, so three chairs. Actually, if I put in here, probably send quote for three Paris chairs, maybe they would have automatically picked that, but anyways. Uh, so now I have a sales quote right here um, and I can finalize everything that I need for that sales quote. I can just hit here as well and say send by email. And I get a new email with the quote uh, and it's sent to Johannes. And so I can just, let me just uh, open that up a little bit. Oops. Uh, and let me just go ahead and edit this. So here I have a PDF of the quote uh, and actually fills in Hello, Addendum Corporation. Thank you for business. Quote is attached to the message. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, looking for 2% discount. And let's uh, say this one is a Yankee fan. So say, go Yankees. <laughs> All right. And now I can just go ahead and send the quote to Johannes. So that was pretty amazing, right? Now that's what I call a nice integration to Outlook. Um, all right, so I hope you got something out of this. Uh, there's definitely really fancy bells and whistles going on here. Uh, until next time, thumbs up if you like this uh, and subscribe if you haven't. Thanks.